Don't watch her. So after a while, we've been waiting for a long time for Marvel to drop that Civil War trailer. And today on Jimmy Kimmel, Robert Downey Jr. and you know Chris Evans, they went up there and they're like, yeah, here's the new poster. And here's the Civil War trailer that all you guys have been asking for. And yeah, right now on Twitter and, and everywhere else, everyone's going freaking crazy. And yeah, as you can guess from my reaction, the Civil War trailer is freaking amazing. First off, we see Captain America and the Falcons down middle, so they go into this room. And spoiler if you haven't seen Ant Man, but in the mid, towards the end credit scene of Ant Man, it's Cap and the Falcon meeting with Bucky. His arm is stuck right there. And then the trailer starts off with that scene. They, you know, but it's different, you know, because Cap asks Bucky if, like, do you remember who I am? And then we see that Bucky's starting to remember Cap. Which is going to be interesting. So from the stuff that we see in the trailer, we see, okay, these guys are going to start working together now. Then after that, we see Thunderbolt Ross coming up and he's talking to Cap saying, look, basically what he's saying is that we have no control over you, us, the government, over the Avengers. And we would like to have more control over you guys because you guys are basically like a vigilante. So you don't mind signing these papers for us. You don't mind, right, that Cap? Right? Right? And you can tell Cap is like, Boy, what are you thinking, man? You think I'm gonna... Nah, I'm not. So let's start on a conflict with Cap and the government. And then we see Tony come up. And basically, we see that Tony is in favor for that. He thinks that the government should have control over the Avengers, you know, the superheroes. But Cap doesn't agree with that. So already, we already know what the feud is. We already know what's gonna be starting the Civil War. Pretty much basic surface of it. And the line that Tony says is like, sometimes I just wanna punch your little perfect teeth. And I'm like, whoa, Tony, First off, you can't do that because it's Captain America. He'll whoop your ass. But damn, Tony. You obviously got some heat on this guy, man. Because if you really think about it, look at all the Marvel Cinematic Universe films where Tony and Cap are together. They've always had conflict. Like after the first Avengers, they kind of had like an understanding of each other. You know, They know that they have different point of views, but they're like, yeah, we can still be buds though. It looks like this time... Uh -uh. And the thing about Captain America The Winter Soldier that I loved so much, personally I think it's the best Marvel solo film and I think it's probably the best MCU film because the way, because it had great action but it was able to have a compelling story and it really treated and developed the character of Captain America really well and the Russo Brothers just did a phenomenal job of that film and you can see from this trailer Civil War looks like it's carrying over the great action, the great fight choreography, the great cinematography shots, you can tell. The Russo brothers, they got it, you know. They're like, oh yeah, I trust trust the Russo brothers because the action in this film looks so amazing. Because, well, yeah, with Avengers Age of Ultron, you can have fun with that. It's mostly just CGI fights, you know. It's just mostly guys fighting nothing. And the thing that I loved about Winter Soldier, it was hand-to-hand -hand combat. It was like one of the things that they said is that they watched the raid to get some influence on that. And I like that from Winter Soldier and it looks like in Civil War, we're going to get a lot of that. What we also saw in the trailer looks like maybe Black Panther could be part of Iron Man scene because we can see this glimpse right here. He kicks the hell out of the Winter Soldier. And there's this one part where he's running like hell. I'm, I'm telling you, he's like Usain Bolt. He's just running towards the looks like Bucky. I'm like, damn. That looks awesome. And towards the end of the trailer, we see Tony holding Rhodes. And it's like, wait a minute. He's not, I'm pretty sure Rhodes is not dead. They wouldn't spoil something like that. It was like, whoa. You see the damage that the Civil War is causing, and my the best part of this whole trailer is that Cap is basically saying, I'm sorry, Tony, I would never do this. And then we see Cap says, but he's my friend. And then the line that's so well delivered by Robert Downey Jr., he just says, so was I. That right there just encompasses so much emotion. You're like, oh, it's right here. And at the end of the trailer is just so badass because you got Bucky and you got Cap. They're just starting to team up like Mortal Kombat. You got Liu Kang and Kung Lao against Scorpion, whoever you want to go against. And they're just kicking the hell out of freaking Iron Man. They're tag team, they're comboing, and you're throwing the shields. It's, it was badass to say the least. And I screamed, you know, very loud like a little girl. It's one of the things I was worried about Civil Wars that since there's so many characters, it was basically Avengers 2.5. You could tell from the trailer, this is Cap's story. While there's so many other characters in the film, they're supporting characters. It's about Cap, which I really liked. 
and I feel like the Rooster Brothers got the hang of this. They really got the emotional aspect of this film. This film is definitely going to be one of the biggest films of next year. Civil War looks so amazing. The fight choreography it looks like it's going to be off the chains. That's what I can tell you right there. I can't wait to see how they utilize Black Panther and Spider-Man. Spider-Man's not going to be a huge part of it. But I want to see how they utilize those characters. I'm glad they didn't show anything of Ant-Man. That's good. So guys, those are my thoughts on the Captain America Civil War trailer. What did you guys think of the trailer? Did you guys like it? Or you thought it was eh? Please let me know in the comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. And as always, ladies and gentlemen, have a nice day.